Jacob Collart, Jacob Collart or Collart Florid C. 1625-1637, was a Flemish admiral who served as privateer and one of the Dunkirkers in Spanish Habsburg service during the Dutch Revolt. He was responsible for the capture or destruction of at least 150 fishing vessels, bringing 945 captured sailors back to his base in Dunkirk for ransom. A leading admiral over the next decade, he would have later encounters with other Dutch corsairs of the period, including Captain Cleese, Campan, who escaped from him after sighting the corsair off the Spanish coast. Biography From 1633 until 1637, Collard served as vice admiral with the Royal Squadron operating out of Dunkirk, and in 1635, his attacks against Dutch herring redders would cost the city of Flushing Vilesingen over two million guilders in income. Although the city of Dunkirk was under a Dutch blockade during early 1635, the blockade was temporarily weakened as several warships under Lieutenant Admiral Phillips Van Dorp were supporting French naval forces in the Gulf of Biscay and on 14 August, Colliert sailing out of Dunkirk successfully broke through the Dutch blockade with a fleet of 21 vessels. Within three days, Collart's fleet located a herring fleet numbering 160 under the guard of a single man-of-war, armed with 39 guns and an 85-man crew. Easily disabling the escort, 74 vessels were either sunk or set afire with the surviving vessels escaping to the VLI. On 19 August, after chasing off the six men-of-war escorts, Collart's forces destroyed around 50 herring boats near Doggersbank. Of the surviving fishermen, 150 sailors, including wounded, as well as the young and the elderly, were put on a merchant vessel from Hamburg and returned to the Dutch Republic, while the remaining 775 were held captive for ransom. After this latest attack, a Dutch fleet was soon raised by the States General of the Netherlands, who ordered all available vessels to set out after the Collart's fleet. Sailing from Rotterdam, its commander Willem Cod van der Birch was ordered to rendezvous at the Texel with Philips van Dorp, recently returning from La Rochel, and Vice Admiral Quast. Collart soon encountered the Dutch fleet of van der Birch and van Dorp, consisting of a combined twenty warships, and managed to damage four before the arrival of Quast's fleet forced Collart to abandon the fight. In part due to bad weather, Collart was able to escape to Dunkirk arriving with 975 captive fishermen on 8 September 1635. The following year, while sailing with two other privateers, Collart and Matthew Rombautsen were captured, the third captain managing to escape to an English port near deep after a five-hour battle against Captain Johann Evertsen on 29 February 1636. Collart died of an illness at a corona in August 1637. He had a son who was also a privateer, Jack Collier the Younger, and was the father-in-law of the later English Vice Admiral Edward Sprague.